everyone, it's Gin and Tonic coming to you with another JNT weekly update. I got spikes on my neck, what the fuck? After a long and amazing day with Ryder Labs makeups from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. today was spent in the makeup chair in front of the camera. I just finally got home, I haven't eaten all day, I'm fucking exhausted. Mmm, crack. More about that later, I wanna tell you about this last week. So many amazing things happened. What the fuck happened this last week? I'm kind of delirious. You ever have one of those nights where it's like a late night and you have to be up really early next day and you're like, this better be the best fucking five hour sleep of my life. And instead, your brain is like, Hey, hey Jin, hey Jin, are you up? Hey Jin, you remember, do you, uh, do you remember when like three years ago you got laid off from your job as a personal trainer? Uh, the bitch replaced you with her shitty husband. Do you remember that? You know what we should have done? We should have called her. Yeah, we should have called her. I'm lying there going, yeah, brain, we should have called her. We could have told her a lot of mean stuff. We would have been really eloquent, and here's all the mean stuff. Wait, what the fuck? I gotta get no sleep. I gotta be up early. So I had one of those nights where I got no sleep, and I've been working all day, so I might be a little delirious. More coffee. I resisted the urge to get some fucking Jack in the Box. I'm just gonna make me some trademark fancy ramen. Is that kind of racist since I look like an anime character right now? Ahahaha. Gin and tonic on. <laughs> What was I talking about? Oh yeah, okay. This last week has been awesome. Big highlight, me and my friend, Nymph Gwendolyn Jane, who you may recall from last week's video. If you haven't watched it, stop being stupid. Go watch the fucking video, it's so good. We were invited to go be part of a radio show down at Skidrow Studios known as Blame It On Ginger. Do you ever have those days where you get home and your fern asks you, hey Jin, how is your day? Well, fern, his name's Gulliver, by the way. He's got a new friend. Thanks for asking, Gulliver. Today, the infamous Ginger Lynn adult movie star asked if she could smell the underside of my boobs. Which, of course, I said yes. Safe to say we both really enjoyed that. I spent the majority of that show topless. Gwen ended up doing an awesome fucking strip tease. So I have to give a big thank you to Girls and Corpses magazine for bringing us two along on that radio show. That was a blast. Keep an eye out for the April issue of Girls and Corpses magazine as I will be in it. Had a couple other photo shoots this week and check this shit. Boom. I'll just kick it for you. Got me a belated Valentine's gift. My newest, tallest, sexiest heel. Thanks to Jay Seekerson Photography. <laughs> They're so sexy, I can't even stand in them without breaking my ankle. And then, of course, there was today's blurry, amazing event with Ryder's Lab makeups. I don't even think I'm saying it right. I went through three fucking fantastic looks with makeup artists from all over the country. My first look was super sexy and goth, bringing out the long black wig with Tess Makeup. She is from Austin. Girl, I'll be hitting you up when I'm out that way. My second look was really fun. We went for like Twiggy, but like fetish Twiggy. I finally got a chance to wear my PVC dress thanks to Poor Girl Couture. Twiggy look was by Molly Krause out of North Carolina. I don't think I'll be headed your way anytime soon, girl, but you never know, I'll keep you in touch. And this third awesome look that you see the remnants of here is by a bad bitch named Ashlyn Bones out in Philly. I will definitely be headed that way in May, so I'll be in touch with you, girl. For those of you curious what it is like to be a makeup model, it is oddly relaxing and physically demanding at the same time. A lot of the days are just sitting in a chair. You can't move, you can't talk, you can't do anything while somebody just like, you know, confers and talks about you like you're not there and pokes and prods at your face. My eyes are full of so much gunk. The first time a gal was kind of brushing under my eye, my eyes started to water. I was so tired that I just decided maybe I'll just start crying for real. I just sat there and just let her just poke me in the face. And then all the makeup coming off and that's like the really hard part. Trying to take off a look and put on a new one as fast as possible. There's still black smudges here. Just cover it with more makeup. I'm wearing like 90 pounds of makeup. All I want to be, I just want to be fucking that is not cute. Don't look at me. Oh no, I'm nerdy again. Uh, I gotta take these off. Ah! My eyebrows are glue stick. And they put tape on your face to do the makeup. I got like seven kinds of glue and 20 layers of makeup on. So I'm gonna get to wiping all this shit off. I don't like putting chemicals on my face, besides the makeup, obviously. To take it off, I like to use alcohol-free cucumber witch hazel, vitaminlife.com and it's a pore tightener. And to get off eye makeup and for general moisturization, extra virgin, just like I like my lover, mm. tasting like coconut in a jar. I know what I need. Gwen's in San Diego. I'm gonna drink the last of her Chardonnay. Like I put berries in it, so it's like, 
coffee. Oh, it's so cold. I need you in my body. Oh, that's so easy. Huge shout out to everyone from today's event. You were fucking awesome. I was so excited to work with Jeff Waters. I'm a big fan of his work. It was so great working with you, Jeff. And to Sarah and James, oh my God, you run an amazing event. I can't believe you got to do that for another four days. I did one day and I'm calling it fucking, I'm good. I'm a pussy, fuck. I'll say it. Everybody's links are below, including a link to that episode of Blame It On Ginger. Take a listen. I don't know where you find the video. Stay tuned for the actual photos to be released on Facebook. Feel free to follow me at all the stinks below. <laughs> Feel free to follow me at all of the... <laughs> I'm gonna shoot myself. Just find me. Stalk me. I don't care. I post photos of myself mainly naked and they're good. You should like my photos. Thanks for watching, guys. You're all too kind. New videos every Wednesday. You don't want to miss this quality bullshit. God, my tits are huge. It's so heavy. <laughs> Coming up next week, Vegas. Woo!